Yield TV, your informative, educative, and leadership documentaries. What's up, guys? It's your girl, Amoni Jemfua, and you are welcome to Yield TV, where you get your informative, educative, and leadership documentaries. Before we get into the video, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to my channel. Turn on your post notification bell so that any video that I post, you'll be the first person to have it. As seen in the caption, today I'm about to have a story time with you guys about how I ended up being in a cry. Before that, I just woke up. So, I got to dress up the bed and have some arrangements in the room. Then, we get started. now back to the reason why i am at Accra. i was there i think somewhere last month and a friend of mine sent me a flyer it was a beauty banter like a beauty competition for students that i have to um, fill the form and partake in it so i did so and just last monday or just last week i was there and i had a call that i have to come to Accra for the competition we got to the Accra International Conference Center around 12 30 and I was really disturbed because they told me to be there at 12 and um, people who are really close to me will tell you that I am really punctual I'm really punctual yeah so I was disturbed when I got there around 12 to 12 20 sorry but so we, we entered the hall we entered the conference hall but they were having um a business talk it was a program on its own before the beauty banter so they were having a business talk and they showed us a room where we should go and pack our like we should go and keep our things so we went to the room and um we decided to just be there for some time because um, yeah, we just we just decided to be there and They said what's really pissed me off some way is We normally say 12 o'clock is let's say 1 o'clock, but 12 o'clock is never 5 o'clock If you get what I'm saying 12 o'clock is never 5 o'clock, but guess what? They told us to be there at 12 and I was there at exactly 12 30 but we started the program getting to 5 we started the program when it was getting to 5 p.m. and um, so they called us on stage and um, we, we we just arranged our uh, working tools and other stuff anything that you need then you arrange it with our models so sorry for the background noise guys so we went there with our models and um, we started they gave me 45 minutes to finish with the wig making and styling like everything that I want to do with the wig they just gave me 45 minutes to finish with everything so i managed but guys it was a mixed feeling i was hungry i was angry i was like i was stressed up because 12 is never five but i had nothing to say so i went on stage and did my best what i could so with um the competition was grouped into three categories three categories which was um, may, um bridal makeup special effects makeup and um wig making specifically styling it in a in an avant-garde way and yeah that's basically what i can say like you make the wig and style it in avant-garde way so those who are into wigs will i mean know what i'm talking about so we started and i did what i can and i think among the contestants i was the only person 
coming from Kumase. So they, they kept on saying, um, they kept on mentioning my name and they'll be like, she has done really well. She came all the way from Kumase. She has done really well. So I was flattered and became happy. And um, yeah, basically that was it. So the special effects was the winner and the makeup artist was the first runner up. And guess what? Guess what? <laughs> I was the second runner up. I was the second runner. I did my best, but honestly, the time was it wasn't enough for making a wig. You know, makeup the you can use only like thirty minutes, forty five minutes to do a makeup, but for a wig, like to start from the scratch and do everything, then I style it. Oh my god! But I did my best. I did what I can. I did what I could. So we were done with everything around um around 8 30 p.m 8 30 p.m or something like that yeah so basically that was it that was it your girl is a a good makeover your girl is a good makeover trust me so i did what i could and we were crowned the second runner so basically that was it i hope you enjoyed the story time with me and if you did so kindly like share and subscribe to my channel turn on the post notification bell so that any video that i post you'll be the first person to have it and guys your comments are so special to me so don't forget to comment and like this video stay tuned bye